What's up, Bulldog fans? Steve Leslie, YSNlive.com, your home of the Poland Bulldogs all season long on YSN. Player Profile Playoff Edition, sponsored by WRS Insurance Solutions, the proud sponsor of Poland football. They will have the game Saturday night at Poland Stadium, and we're looking forward to that. It's 7 o'clock against Chagrin Falls. You can watch it on YSNlive.com. But right now we're glad to be joined by Andrew Senefani. He's a senior wide receiver for the Bulldogs. First of all, Andrew, thanks for joining us. Yep, thanks for having me. All right, let's uh, – the first portion of this, let's let's tell Poland Nation a little bit about Andrew Senefani. Talk a little bit about your family, a little bit about yourself, and, and we'll take things from there. Yeah, my family family's great. I have two older siblings, one brother, one sister, both of them pretty good athletes in the family. And my friends, you know, they all play football with me, football and basketball. So it's pretty, pretty good. All right, so who – best athlete come on I'm gonna put you on the spot right there who's the best athlete in the family I think definitely me <laughs> okay that's a good answer that's what we should say Andrew Senefani wide receiver for the Poland Bulldogs first thing Andrew uh your senior year um I've enjoyed watching this football team play I've talked with coach Williams uh this seems like a really tight-knit senior group uh at, at, at a point in time, there would look like there would not be a season. Uh, you get a chance to play. You have a great regular season. Uh, you're home for the playoffs. How special is it for you as a senior to be a part of this and be able to play the game that you love? Extremely special because going into the season, not knowing if we would, you know, play the full season, half the season, you know, what was going on. And with this senior group, we're extremely blessed to be able to have the season and as go as far as we are right now. And we're excited for what to come and we're confident in what we can do. Yeah, there's no question. There, there's no question. It's a confident football team. You go last year uh, to the state semifinals. Um, talk about that a little bit. You get to the state semifinals. Uh, you're, you're going into your senior year. Is that something you guys as a group talked about as seniors? You want to get back to that point? I know it's one game at a time, but what, was that one of your goals is to get back to that spot and hopefully win a state championship? Yeah, definitely getting back to that spot, having a great team last year. And this year we feel like we have just the same amount of chance, if not better, to get there and go to the state championship and win it. So, Yeah, there's no doubt in my mind this football team, Bulldog fans, has an opportunity. Uh, it's one week at a time. They'll play Shrin Falls this week. But in my opinion, a great chance to uh, – hopefully get a state championship back to Poland High School. We're with Andrew Senefani. He's a wide receiver for the Bulldogs on Player Profile Playoff Edition, sponsored by WRS Insurance Solutions. We'll have the big game for you Saturday night at 7 o'clock on YSNlive.com. And we are proud to be the home of Bulldog football all season long. All right, let's jump in here. Last Saturday night, Salem comes to town. Uh we're all watching the game in the studio, Andrew, and I, I, I'm, I'm not going to say I was shocked uh, that uh, the game started out the way it did. Uh, they hit some plays. They stopped you guys a little bit. The game gets the 21 nothing. As a senior, one of the leaders on this football team, take me from that point, 21 nothing. What, what, what's, the, what's the mojo going on on that field right now with you guys as a group? Yeah, I mean, they definitely came out a lot stronger than us and a lot with a lot more enthusiasm. And we came out real flat. And when it was about 21 nothing, I mean, if not by then, we knew we had to turn it on and get things going and play how we really do play. And so that drive where Christian threw me the deep ball for a touchdown definitely gave us some momentum. Yeah, that was a great pass. That, that was a great pass. It was a great touch, a great catch. That was a big play. But – as I watched that game, I seen you guys, uh, the O-line starts to get a little more push on the running plays. But I was impressed with the defense. After the 21 points were scored, um, you guys stopped them very, very well. Got some pressure on the quarterback, Coach Johnson's son, who's going to be a very good player as a quarterback for Salem. Uh, I was impressed defensively. Uh, talk about uh, the end of the half I, I want to talk about. We talked off air about this. I we're watching it. and. We're on our audible call and we're watching the game and we see the pile moving. It looks like everybody's laying in a blue end zone. Uh, no touchdown call. But the thing that, that impressed me the most was after the signal of no touchdown, I watched 
the body language of your football team going off the field. And I did not see any frustration. And I, I remember saying to a lot of guys that this game's a long way from over. Uh, what were some of the things that were talked about at halftime going into that second half? Um, just, I mean, we're playing. We finally got a little bit of momentum after score and, and we drove right down on them. We had a little bit of unlock towards the goal line. I mean, not punching it in from the two yard line, but we definitely knew we could, play better and stop them on defense they were trying to spread us out and one of our coaches coach Nunzio our defensive coordinator they were setting up in like quads to one side four people and we he made a good adjustment at halftime and we stopped that and that really got us going yeah well shout out to coach and shout out to the defense shout out to the whole staff it was a great second half obviously you dominate the second half you get a win you move into uh uh, this week against Chagrin Falls, we're with Andrew Senefani, player profile. He's one of the, the leaders of the football team, Bulldog Nation. So they need all the help they can get. Uh, we'll have it for you on YSN Live if you don't have a ticket. The bye week. Uh, a lot of coaches, a lot of players like to continue to play. Do you attribute some of the slow start to a bye week and not being in that normal routine? Um, I think it is because of the bye week a little bit. but. I mean, we did have great practice throughout the bye week and the week coming in. Like we just started real flat, and I think the bye week it actually helped us a lot, you know, running some new formations and new plays we got. We haven't ran all of them, but we definitely got some in our bag. Well, but, yeah, yeah. Yeah, keep those in your bag for sure. We don't have to talk about that. A lot of people will watch this profile. <laughs> let's keep those in the bag. But let's talk about Andrew Senefani. Uh After – your senior year at Poland, what is Andrew Senefani look at himself as doing? Is, is football, hopefully, would you like to continue playing football and get into college? Yeah, I would love to, whether, you know, I have a scholarship or walking on somewhere. I definitely love football and love the game, and I'd like to continue playing. Well, we, we see that you love the game. I like watching you play the game. Again, that touchdown uh, kind of sparked that whole stadium Saturday night, got the juices flowing for Bulldog Nation, got your teammates going. So, you know, hats off on that. And uh, Thank you. best of luck, you know, after this football season in the college, we know you will do well. But let's jump into this week. Chagrin Falls comes to town. Uh, how exciting is it, first of all, Andrew, to play another home game? And if you win another home game the following week, talk about being able to stay at home and play. That has to be exciting as a senior. Yeah, for sure get as many home games as we can especially on the last season definitely have a home field advantage with a crowd and everyone coming in yeah and, yeah it's a great place to play there's no doubt about that it's a great stadium you guys have played very well there for the four years you've been there so take advantage of that opportunity uh you, you practice this week i'm sure you've watched some film on chagrin falls talk a little bit about chagrin falls the opponent coming into town saturday night you know they're really well on the team like kind of like we are, you know, they like to run the ball, do some play action passes. They have a good punter and kicker, a coach like to say, which, you know, be exciting for all aspects of the game on Saturday night. Yeah, special teams are a big part. There's no doubt offense, defense, and special teams. Your special teams are outstanding and have been all year. So it'll be a good football game, Bulldog fans. Chagrin Falls will come to town 7 o'clock Saturday night on YSNlive.com. Hope you join us. Uh, we wish you, Andrew, the best of luck. We'll, we'll, before we let you get off here, we're going to do a little rapid fire, ask you a few questions to, to get Bulldog Nation a little know a little bit more about Andrew Senefani. Uh First one, let's go uh, favorite color Gatorade. Definitely blue. Okay, blue. Um, Andrew's hype music as you're out on the field for pregame. What is it? Hype music? Yeah. All kinds, rap. I mean, listen to rap. You know, a okay. lot of Meek Mill or any guy like that. Okay. I, I can accept that. I'm a little older, but uh, rap yeah. is a popular <laughs> answer on player profiles. That's a good one. Um, favorite class you've had at Poland High School? Favorite class, like, uh, academically? Yeah, any class you've taken. Which, which, what's your favorite class? Um, I'd have to say... Either one of the math is one of the okay. math, math classes. I'm pretty good at math. Like, okay. I've always been the advanced. Math is, that's not an easy subject. All right. Off of that, 
Shout out to one of your favorite math teachers in Poland. It's all on him right now. Give him a shout out, him or her. Yeah, Coach Sonato, big shout out. He he comes to most of our practices and he's in the box on Saturday nights. Okay. So, Coach Sonato, thanks for all you do, not only on the football field, but getting my man here some math work because that's not an easy subject. Hats off to you for, for uh, being so good in math. That will carry you on um, in your future here down the road. Favorite college football team? Ohio State Buckeyes. I'm excited. This week they finally get to play. Um, I think it's a good football team. What are your thoughts on Ohio State? Yeah, I think they're real good this year. Justin Fields, good receivers. You're a receiver. You like that. Um, yeah. Pound, pound you know, it would be good. nice for you a senior year, win, win, a, win a state championship as a Bulldog, because I think the Buckeyes have a chance to win a national championship. Yeah, that would be good. a bad senior season for Andrew Senefani. Yeah, I'd love that. <laughs> How about uh, favorite pro team? Pittsburgh Steelers. Oh, Andrew. <laughs> yeah, I'm a Browns fan, so you're – You've had the upper hand since you were born, so I, I have to accept that. We bought into all the hype again this past week that we were better, and it's the same old stuff with us Browns fans. You guys just own us, but the Steelers are a good football team. Um, your thoughts on, as a receiver, Chase, Chase Claypool, man. Yeah. Pittsburgh always finds good receivers. I know. When they were drafting him, I thought we were going to be taking like a running back you know, right. in the second round. And they pull him out. Like, I knew he was real talented, you know, 6'4". Right. He compares to Megatron. Right. That's a good comparison. He he is going – I think Big Ben is in his glory when they get in the red zone to go to him. Yeah. Uh, who do you – is there anybody you model your game after? As a football player, who do you, you want to be like? Is there anybody out there you try to model? Um, I'd say – I don't know. I have a combination between, like, you know, wanting to go up and get the ball or being the speedy guy out of the backfield or on special teams. Okay. So, like, you know, mixture of a guy like Julio or – Okay. That's a good answer. Set, like Julio does a little bit of everything. Yeah. Talk about the running back spot, but I like that. I, I like seeing you in the backfield getting the ball a little bit. That that's a, that's a, That has to be exciting. Yeah, I know. If we have a chance to run it this week, Definitely be excited for that. I've been waiting for it. <laughs> but see, for Bulldog Nation, we can hold on to stuff like that. If we're winning a game, doing what we do, we keep doing it. And yeah. we we'll hold on to those things. Last question for you as a senior. How do you want this season, end? Well, what do you want to see this team do? Definitely want to see us win a state championship. I mean, I know we can. We have the potential to do it. And we just got to go out there and show it. And I just want us to have fun doing it. That's all. Oh. You know what? You hit a lot of important things. Salute to you and the football team because, number one, you definitely have the talent to do it. Number two, you guys work very hard as a group. And number three, it all starts again Saturday night against Chagrin Falls. So on behalf of DJ Oakley, our owners, and Brian Scott and myself, I, I wish you nothing but the best, Andrew. You represent Poland football so well. You represent Poland High School and the community of Poland so well. Hats off for all you do on and off the field. And uh, go have fun Saturday night. Beat Chagrin and uh, continue that quest for a state championship. We were glad to uh, get you on air and have you be part of a special senior year for this Bulldog group. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Yes, right. You have a good night. Absolutely. Go beat Chagrin and have some fun. Yes, sir. All Thank right. You. Have a good night. Thanks, Andrew. You too.